So Paris Saint-Germain in the blue throw off against Fredericia of Denmark in the white shirts and red shorts here. Tunnison straight through. And that is going to be the danger if you play deep. Anderson Young on the right wing. AB is in on the left uh, wing. Steins has gone in on the line. Be the shortest line play in Champions League history, but uh, it won't. In the centre, William Anderson Morber, number 31. Swedish player, Yannick Dean, who's. That would be a bit rare payoff for a place in the quarterfinals. In the bottom two, which is where Federici is sitting at the moment, go out in the group stages. That's the first goal for them. And it comes courtesy of Martin Bisco. Absolutely towering figure, Sipschak, two meters and seven, the Polish international. But he's quick, he gets away from his marker and scores. 12 goals so far this season, looking for the line. Paris Saint-Germain with the uh, injuries to Sule and Yahya Omar. They're on a passive play call now, and that's fine. Tunison lets rip with a long-range effort. Gets his second. Three issues. He was alone from Toulouse and uh, ended up staying with the club. Oh, Sipsabal, the defence, closes quickly. Now to the line. Vidarsson, and he scores. That's three from three penalty scored in the... And the PSG have gone five minutes without scoring now. So whilst they've got a comfortable lead, and that's going to help. And that's the first goal of the season. Yeah, struggling with injuries, and uh, they've been relying on Sule on his own. And now it's Sule who's got a hand injury on the right side. Always lost. The break is on. Now they've got a chance, and there's no goalkeeper to worry about. Really has uh, been such a great player for the club, Sipchak. Pondy all the way through. Have uh, decided to try and uh, take matters into hand. Seven against six attack. There's no goalkeeper. They're trying to get him back in again, and he won't get there. Goodmanson gambles, takes out the goalkeeper, puts on an extra attack. Time. Get on with uh, Sporting. Into the wing. That's a decent angle this time. And Kasper Anderson scores. Chance goes begging, but Grevy gets a second chance. The greatest players of all time. And, uh, he was a PSG player until the summer. He's now retired. Oh, it's a nice little... <laughs> Anderson Moberg, incidentally, who scored on the uh, last attack for Frederesia, but now Taboada adds another. Staines. Tunison. Try and spread it a bit. That's an attacking foul. Run into the defender. Break is on. The wing, big angle again. And came off just before the team timeout. Giving possession away again, making life easy. And PSG now struggling with this deep 3 3 defense, and that's Emerson. Rolled right back into the keeper. Compare that with the 35% save rate he has in the domestic competition in Denmark, where he's second in the rankings. He's not quite found his game yet in the Champions League. Tries to find a way through into Pevnov. And now Bayerns is back off, being used primarily in defence. Ah, oh, Pondy. 
Canes have got another 25 seconds to go before they're back to full strength. No goalkeeper at the other end as they put on the extra player in attack. Tabuada, that goes wide. Rush for PSG. Hardy. Good play. And a good save. Well, wouldn't have counted. We prefer not to have Pondy in defence. They're back to full strength again now, Fredericia. Oh, good play again. Breakthrough. Tries to go for the broken. To the wing, huge angle as well. And Fredericia have really found a good rhythm here. Martin Biscor with his second. From five goals up, it was 10-5 to PSG. A 6-1 exchange. Oh, nice change of direction. Steins, Anderson Morbert. We're checking how many passes are left. It's more than one by the looks of it. Or is it? Oh, what a shot. Brilliant. Anderson Morbert. On the wing. Steins, passive play call against France. And that's a penalty. His penalty so far this season in the Champions League. And scores that one. Looks for the line. They're hoping it flattens the defence, may give some chances for Tabuada on the long range shooting. Oh, good play. Nice efforts on the wing. And Martin. Lions now is staying on for the attack. Good play. That's first of the game for Danny Bayerns. A new signing from Hamburg this summer. Fantastic support to the uh, team. Tabuada. To the wing again. And he saved the last second penalty to secure the points in a 24-23 away win for Paris Saint-Germain. Oh, what a pass to the line! They haven't conceded too many empty goals. Just the one so far, Tabuada, nearly dispossessed. Oh, lovely spin on the ball as well, and brilliant save, Palika. Three goals for his country. Character. Passive play call now against Paris. Both teams are drawing quite a few. Bayern tries a long range effort. It does well. And the ball is stolen superbly by Luke Steins, who's reached out. Trying to shore up and uh, give a bit of confidence so that they can cover the wings. Oh, it's stolen the empty goal. Saved himself the run in Beijing in 2008. First ever medal for them. So that sails wide. Steins races forward. Bayern has a quick look. Then this year, Fries. What can you do against Sipschak? Ah, oh, they like. There's no safety there. And still, it's seven against six. No goalkeeper at the other end. Levy goes in on the line, Bayerns. Oh, brilliant save. But a lucky rebound. He's good for a penalty so far. For a break. Half time score. So, this year, throw off the second half. They really are sucking the defence in and looking for chances on the wing. Straight from the middle. Passive play call now against Fredericia. Dummies the shot. Goes to the wing. That's a slightly... The hand off. Tabuada. Anderson Moorberg in the centre. With that, just a play on. Passive play again. Andy. Look for the line instead, and it's intercepted, and the break is on. Fredericia, what a pass! Oh, what a save, Palika! Brilliant! Oh, what a save, Palika! Brilliant! Pondy! Oh, quick 
breakthrough and the defence a little too static and they pay the price immediately. Jonas Christensen. Uh, Pardy with the more direct. Went on to uh, win the title, beating Denmark in the final, also in extra time. Pardy is. That's paid dividends again and again, and a rare miss this time, though, for Martin Biscor. He gets lovely service from Anderson Moorberg again. Pardy. Steins had to stay down, he was far enough away from the goal. Stop. Anderson Moorberg, third one. Tennyson tries to release the ball, and he does, and Paul. Here in this uh, group A. Bottom two teams will go out of the competition. But the referee says no, thank you. Passes with a little bit of spin on it. Tabuada eventually. Add that to the 19 in the Danish league. Nicely. A bit of luck for uh, Fredericia. They need it. Oh, he's stolen. Niggling injuries, but uh, glad to be on the court here today. Covering for Sule. Oh. Christensen back again, number three. Norberg Anderson going wide. Oh, beautifully done. Moved around the front. Here we go again, they're back to within two. Change on the line for PSG. Ruben Marchand comes in. Fine player, Spanish international. Another one who played previously at Nord. PSG who could move up into third place if they win here today. There he is. It looks like uh, the French are going to go... Not on, on this side. Balagi is trying to uh, discourage a pass long range from the other side. Oh, good sidestep. That's very nicely done. And Mats Kilgore gets his first of the game. Oh, and a mistake. And he gets two in 15 seconds. Yeah, now the general manager, Narcisse, is the sports coordinator. And his son is on the bench here today, Noah Narcisse. Thorsten Fries, who's been marginally the more successful of the two keepers from the penalties this season at home and in the Champions League. Can he stop Sipschak? No, he can't. To the passive play a little bit closer if he can keep doing it. They're trying to speed up the tempo here to suck the defence in. It's just a free throw. On the to the line, Sipschak. Uh, with a pass that PSG would be hoping to get a good big win here and try and make some inroads on their goal difference, which sits at minus 10 at the moment. Oh, what a goal! Midway through, the referee seem to be having a look at him. The official may come over and have a word with him in a minute if he carries on. the line, yes! Again, the empty goal at the other end. No one home there. Both teams happy to take the risk. Oh, what a pass behind the back and what a finish! That was nicely finished. Oh, the defence, flat-footed. They they are hanging on for all their worth here. I'm hoping that a little bit of panic might just set in. And uh, yes, you will be acutely aware of that. Both teams playing seven against six, taking that chance with the empty goal at the other end. Big angle for the wing, and a big save, Palika. Fantastic.
Mondi. But it's cancelled out almost immediately, and there's the line it was covered. Steins just didn't fancy uh, threading that ball between the two defenders. The line players, in particular Sipschak, but uh, Marchand as well. They're not defending. Switch with Pondy is the first one they do. Into the wing, that's clever play. Big angle. And a good save. Nine minutes of the match remaining. Tunnison this time served up by Steins. And Palika has managed to get back in goal this time. Tunnison is on four goals now into the wing. Opens up the angle. Couldn't close the gap. And uh, Gudmundsson will know that. But uh, Fredericia having just as much problem with the uh, PSG. Seven against six as uh, PSG are having. on the Federici attack, but uh, the defence is coping just a little bit better. They've managed to isolate the five uh, scoring spell in the last ten minutes. Kjellgaard into the wing, again, good angle. Brilliant play, first half, but very high for both teams, in fairness. And hence this uh, high. So, Sipschak. Oh, and he saves! First half into the wing. Poor pass, though, by the time he'd recovered it. So, played one match in the uh, Champions League so far. No goals, didn't really get on court. Now he gets a chance. His father, though, scored 943 goals for France in his time. Taking multiple World European and Olympic titles at home, gets in on it. He scored top scoring for Fredericia. Looking for the line, misconnects. And this time Palika has a go and scores. Well, that champagne goal. Does no harm at the end. Oh, did he just mount it? And we go into the last minute. And, uh, Paris Saint Germain. Have worn down Federicia in this. This may well be the last attack if they take their time over it. Bayern's in the second. Pondy with nine goals. Sipschak with. Needs to be sent back, taken from the wrong place. And they've got eight seconds. Goal difference could still come in handy. Long shot. That up in the corner. 